Hi everyone, and welcome to another grocery shopping video, another grocery haul. And I hope you will subscribe and ring the little bell to be notified of um, new videos. Hope you will like the video, but mainly I hope you will just watch the video. All right, I've got my shopping list here. And I best get busy before anybody else clicks me off. And this is from Publix this time. This is actually a Publix brand. I guess I have to wear my glasses. I hate to do that. But that's the reality of things now. So here's Taboli right here. Taboli. This was $4.50. I'm going to mark everything off right here. Oh, how convenient. The Tabali is at the very top here. Well, it says $6.39 on the list. What? Oh, I've already messed up. I couldn't read without my glasses. I should have put them on to start with. Here's the Tiboli. Four dollars and fifty cents. And we'll move this over here right now. I love Tibolis. It's a North African Mediterranean, maybe it's a Middle Eastern kind of food which I first discovered when I was in France in 1982. Traveling around with my backpack, almost broke. Activia yogurt. There are one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight in a pack. It's Activia, that's six dollars and 39 cents. Is that a three or an eight? I think it's a three. That means eight divided by 630, 639 divided by eight. Oh, I don't want to use my brain. 639 divided by eight. It's about 79, 80 cents. And we will ignore the tax right now. I wish we could ignore taxes in general and not have to pay them. But somebody has to prop up the waste and the efficiency of the government. And here is the Driscoll's strawberries. Oh, it smells so good. Mm. I wish there was a perfume or a cologne that smelled like, well, strawberries, blueberries, anything like that. And these are, here they are at the top, $4. Organic strawberries, $4. It says I saved $2 there. Why didn't they just Mark it down two dollars, or is that a discount at the end? I don't know. But anyway, let's move on before people start clicking off even more. What have we here? What have we? Here? This is a. Uh, why do I have to look at the label? I know what these are. I just can't think of the name. Where did you see them though? Um, I forgot to mark the strawberries off. No, I didn't. I just couldn't read it. Okay, these are romaine. And this was $5.00. It doesn't say it's by the pound or anything. It just says it's four ninety nine. Okay. It's 
This is romaine. These are onions. Onions. So where is that on here? Right there. They're green and organic green onions. Two for three dollars. So they charge me here three dollars. Does that mean they're at two? Okay. It's like more than well, yeah, you know, I guess they're grouped together like kinda like two then. Okay. I can hear some of this off the table. Drop these on the floor. Okay. Now, there's probably some more cold items. I learned that when I'm going to make a, food, a uh, shopping video, that I need to buy all the perishables first, the cool things that are supposed to stay cool so that I take them, I put them in the, all the cool things in the card at once and take them out that way, put them in the refrigerator for a few minutes until I have everything ready to go. Now here is the romaine that I mentioned a while ago, mistakenly. The romaine, Garden Life Romaine, uh, $4.99. And by the way, you can tell me in the comments what you pay for these items or whether you think the price has gone up or gone down over the last year or so. As far as four years ago, everything has gone up, it looks like. And drumsticks. This is three... I should have brought my magnifying glass. This is two pounds, just over two pounds, and it's four dollars and eighty-five cents. Okay. There we are. Four eighty-five. Doesn't say that they were organic or anything. It does say that I saved sixty-three cents. Is that real? Who knows? Now that's all the perishable stuff. Let's go next with the non-perishables. Good pink salmon. Okay, we have the pink salmon here. Okay. And this was four forty nine. One a day gummies. A multivitamin from Vita Craves. Do you take vitamins? Maybe you should. These are nineteen dollars and ninety-nine cents. Twenty dollars. How many are in here? Well, it doesn't really say, I don't guess. It should be on the number of servings, though. There's two in a serving, and there are... Well, I can't read it anyway. Next time I'll just bring my... I remember to bring my, my magnifying glass. Olive Garden, Italian. He's an Italian. He's a guy that be, better be good. Olive Garden. 
And actually, we, we discovered this when we were at Olive Garden some years ago. And we liked it on the salad, so we found some at the store. Olive Garden dressing. It's four dollars and forty-nine cents. What's next? Gatorade. This is zero, zero sugar Gatorade. I think we saw, just happened to see this in the store, and I'm a diabetic now, as of recently. So we decided to try this, to pick some up. Haven't really tried it yet. But the regular Gatorade has a lot of sugar in it. You're supposed to drink Gatorade whenever you're sick or you know, to build up your strength for some reason. But I didn't think about it being unhealthy and having so much sugar. But it was, I can't remember how much it was, but it was a lot. So we had two or three, two or th three bottles of the, of the regular Gatorade. And just today we gave it to the, to the boy that was mowing our grass for us since I can no longer um, mow the grass outside and it's just too hot. So now we have to pay somebody. But I'm hoping that with the cooler weather and I'll be better that I can go back to mowing again. And I have a half an acre to mow. So here's the, the zero Gatorade. This is, yeah, it says zero sugar. This is orange. And this one is, where's the name of it? Glacier, Glacier Freeze, okay? These were $2. Is that $2 total? No, it's $2 each. So I paid four dollars in in total for that, two dollars a piece. Move that over there and make room for the water. The most wasteful, unnecessary thing that you can buy. My wife likes this Dasani bottled water. And how much is that? The Sunny. It was two dollars and twenty nine cents. We can get all the water we want to from the from the faucet. I'll leave that there. Here goes. Potatoes. How much were these potatoes? Uh, sweet potatoes, so they were $2.33 a pound. And I got 1.6 pounds, so they were $3.70. Sweet taters. These are the world's smallest gourmet potatoes. That's what it says. It's by something called Tasteful Selections. Sweet potatoes. I just can't see up close with these glasses very well if it's too close. Here it is, they were five, five dollars. Potato nibbles, nibbles, five dollars. Writing.
Kiwis. Kiwi. Kiwis were five for five dollars. So six dollars and twenty-five cents. So maybe we got like one, two, three, four, five, or six. I don't know. These are a variety of grits, Quaker grits. I half lived on these whenever I was, whenever I couldn't eat anything. And you have the original, the butter, cheddar cheese, and country bacon. And these were $4.31. Okay. Peaches. Two, four peaches. Again, I wish there was a perfume or a cologne <laughs> that smelled like ripe peaches. And I'll keep getting these as long as they last, as long as we're in the season. These were two pounds for three dollars a pound and they charge me six dollars so what does that mean six dollars or three dollars a pound so I got are this two pounds I don't know Some black eyed peas oh yeah It's going to be good. Black eyed peas. And here they are, two dollars and nine cents. Or as people in the South say, sometimes they leave off the, uh, the plural on the cent, so it's like, yeah, these cost me two dollars and nine cent. And sweet pota sweet tomatoes or tomatoes, however you want to say it, by Sunset, the Sunset brand. Okay, and these were. It's about the last thing on the list, and there they are. Four dollars, but there was a promotion. So minus two dollars, that means they cost about two dollars. These tomatoes were two dollars. So the total for the entire list, all this stuff, was ninety-four seventy plus the tax, a dollar ninety-six, and a food tax, two eighty-one. The total was ninety-nine dollars and forty-seven cents. $99.47 for everything I showed you. And this says my special savings was $6.67. I should have asked them for the six sixty-seven when I was there. Just got the change, you know, the cash. But I forgot it. Of course, they, they impute that savings in getting to the total of the bill. And that's about it. So... I hope you all have a, a good week and try to, try to stay cool because it's so hot and peace out.